Welcome to another edition of the 414, your local Marquette University news program. I'm Josh Groves. And I'm Blake Rupi. Here's what is happening in and around the 414. This Friday, the 9th Annual Brady Street Walking Food Tour will explore Milwaukee's east side neighborhoods. The walk is slightly over a mile long and will be between two and two and a half hours. Approximately 20 minutes each will be spent at the restaurants. There will also be plenty of trivia involving Milwaukee's history. A Tony Award winning musical, The Million Dollar Quartet, is set for 7 p.m. October 21st at the Fireside Dinner Theater. Million Dollar Quartet is set on Christmas Eve in 1956 when an extraordinary twist fate brought Johnny Cash, Jerry Lee Lewis, Carl Perkins, and Elvis Presley together at Sun Records in Memphis for what would be one of the greatest jam sessions ever. Relive some of the most popular songs ever written, Great Balls of Fire, Walk the Line, and Hound Dog on a night that will be nothing short of memorable. A new app development club is providing students with the chance to learn how to make their very own smartphone programs. The creator started the mobile app development club in April to educate students on how to program apps. Students will learn how to make many programs through iOS software on their smartphones. While the club is still in the training process, members have shown an interest in developing apps that could help the Marquette community in the future. For the first time ever, Marquette is offering a January session as an additional option for students to take classes outside the traditional fall and spring semesters. These inaugural J sessions will run from December 19, 2016 to January 14, 2017, and will offer four online courses and two study abroad courses. Other universities have programs similar to the J session, like the University of Wisconsin-Milwaukee. It's not too late for students to register for J session classes, as they may do so through Checkmark. The Behavior Clinic, a new partnership between Marquette University and the Penfield Children's Center, received a five-year grant of nearly $2 million to provide trauma-focused treatment for children in a few, for in a few, day, a few days ago. The Behavior Clinic provides in-home counseling and services that cater to a child's early development. The money will be used wisely, and they hope to have more success in the near future. Well, if you're still going to be on campus over fall break, something that might get you out of the dorm is to come to the Al McGuire Center this Friday as the Marquette women's volleyball takes on the Providence Friars. Game is at 7 as the Golden Eagles look for their 8th Big East win. Well, that's all we have for you guys tonight. Thanks for joining us. I'm Josh Groves. And I'm Blake Rupi. Have a great fall break, Marquette.